I'm standing here on hollow ground. And the reason why I say that is that I have this feeling that I'm in the presence of something sacred. I love coming to see something like this because to me it's as amazing and as beautiful and as awe-inspiring as any temple or any sacred site. And the sacred part to me is what's done with instruments like this. The exploration, the discovery. But where I have a connection is that all of this started with William J. McDonald, the amateur astronomer who had a small telescope. And that small telescope inspired him to want to build something grand like this because that small telescope took him across the universe. The power of a small telescope is to propel you to explore on your own and to witness the universe for yourself. And who knows where it would take you? For William J. McDonald, it took him to imagine that a research institution like this could be built. And it is still his legacy, but it is also something that is a living, thriving thing that continues on to this very day. This is an incredible dark sky night. It is like being in a temple of stars. Earlier we were talking about what a small telescope could do. Well, I can tell you that I was able to look at a galaxy millions of light years away. And to see something like that and to really start exploring and start discovering things for yourself is really what changes you. It doesn't cost anything to get into astronomy and in fact, probably going to cost nothing because you probably already have one of these in your garage or up in your attic right now. The experience that you're going to get when you come out under the dark skies and you explore with your eyes is going to change you forever. It's time to get out there and start exploring. It's time to make those discoveries for yourself.